everyone out there, it's Roberto Mickey again, and we've got a great video today. It's actually a video that's an accompaniment to an article that we wrote back in 2021. The article is actually free to read on PubMed, and here's the title of the case report if you want to go and look for it. And this is a link to that article. We'll have it in the description as well. The next plane on device is an implantable contraceptive device, and it prevents pregnancy in women when it's implanted beneath the skin. These are screenshots from the company's website, and according to the company, it's 99% effective in preventing pregnancy when it's implanted below the skin. It is usually implanted in the office and removed in the office, but in this case, a obstetrician referred the patient to us, secondary to the fact that the implant migrated deep and it was too deep to remove in the office. So consistent with the company's advertising, the implant is radio opaque and can be seen on x-ray and fluoroscopy. And here it is. Here's the original image with some red arrows marking the actual device. And here's the device zoomed in. According to the company, the implant can be seen on MRI, but when we obtained an MRI, we were unable to identify the implant. This was probably because the implant, as we found in the operating room, was directly below the fascia and was up against it, and hence probably indistinguishable from the overlying fascia. This is a cross-sectional ultrasound of the implant, and you can see that little white dot there in the middle of the image. That is the implant. This is a longitudinal view of the implant, and there it is with the red arrows marking the implant so you can see it. And you can see it's right up against the fascia or right below the fascia in this case. And this is a better still image of the ultrasound imaging of the actual implant. You can see it right there with the red arrows. A warning to everyone, the rest of the video does contain images from a surgery. So if you don't want to see the inside of someone, please click away. Here are some intraoperative photographs of the device seen below the fascia. And here's some arrows marking that. And here is a photo of us removing the implant. You can see it's below the fascia and it's just sticking out right there. We used a pair of scissors to dissect it out. And this is a photograph of the actual device removed. And we measured it just to make sure that we removed the entire device. We also obtained fluoroscopy images intraoperatively after the implant was removed, confirming that the entire implant had been removed. Well, everyone, thank you for watching. And a plug for our channel, hit like and subscribe so we can continue making these great videos.